What's going on YouTube? It's your girl Amber Smiles Jones and welcome to my channel Professionally Silly. A lot of you have been asking me in the comment section below, you've been asking, how's Leon doing? What's Leon up to? Unfortunately, I haven't been able to go back to where Leon's new home is, especially now because of all that's going on. But Michelle, Leon's new pet parent, has gone ahead and sent me a couple of videos of Leon from her iPhone. So I wanted to go ahead and share that with you today. Check out Leon's new digs. This is Michelle's pond that she has in her backyard where she houses all of her turtles. The last time I was there, she had about 13 of them. And there's Leon right there with her cute self. Yeah, she never did like the camera much. As far as I know, Michelle has been a turtle lover <laughs> since she was a kid and has been an animal lover even before birth. So I definitely could not be more happy with Leon's new home. Oh no, you just covered my view of Leon. What's wrong with you two, huh? She's right there. Oh, this one too. She has actually been taking very good care of my baby baby turtle, Blue. I got him when he was very, very tiny. And she takes care of him. Oh, that's Blue right there. Oh. Blue went back to Leon. Did you sneeze? Bless you. <laughs> Blue has been here for a little longer than Leon. And this one's a new one too. Got that one a few days ago. If you ask me, these turtles are very well cared for and have a great life. Look at them, just chilling. Aw, and there's Leon, leaning on the rock. <laughs> Cute self. Go Leon, go, go, go! <laughs> So judging from the videos that she sent me, Leon is thriving, doing very well, growing. She seems a lot more social, which is awesome. And uh, I think she's enjoying living around all of her turtle friends. When I had Leon, she was very skittish, uh, had anxiety, didn't do well with humans, including myself. And Michelle shared with me that Leon still has a little issues trusting her as well. I think that perhaps the previous owners before I got Leon, obviously they abandoned her to die with no food and water. Who knows what they did when they were actually home? I don't really know. But as of right now, Leon is doing very well, very happy. So big fucking ups to Michelle for helping me keep Leon happy. She has done an amazing job with her. I certainly hope that you guys are keeping safe, being smart during this quarantine time, or maybe you have a stay at home order. Just make sure you're washing your hands, you're staying six feet from people, you ain't coughing nobody's face. You know what I'm saying? Don't be rude. And don't be rude. And I promise that I will do what I can to keep you guys entertained during this time here on my channel or on my podcast, also called Professionally Silly. Speaking of which, I've just dropped a new podcast episode and we were discussing the Uber killer. Yeah, yep, just like the Rideshare app. So I'll make sure I drop a link down below and you guys can take a listen to that. 
Guess what time it is? It's time to go ahead and check out your feature comments for one of my past videos. We're gonna go ahead and check out the comments that's coming from my Taki infused tequila shots video. Let's go ahead and see what we got here. All right, so first comment is coming from my girl, Addiction. Every time I say her name, I say that. But Addiction says, oh man, now my mouth is watering. I remember leaving a comment and I remember responding, that's what she said. Make sure you guys go ahead and check out Addiction's YouTube channel as well. She is fire. Fuego, baby. Just like those Taki infused tequila shots. Our next comment is coming from Positive Vibes Tings. And uh, Positive Vibes says, that was a good prank. I really didn't see that coming. That, I remember that video. That was when I pranked you guys into thinking that I cut my thumb. Yeah. I got you on that one, that was a good one. And, and to be honest with you, it was really last minute. Our next comment is coming from Hungry Visionary, and Hungry Visionary says, you just have a really warm and approachable personality, and I'm super glad that you make content. Well, I, thank you. <laughs> All right, so our next comment is coming from Jess Little, and Jess says, that shot sounds dangerously delicious and highly addictive. That shot is all those things. If you guys haven't already, go ahead and smash that thumbs up button to support this channel, and of course your girl, okay? Because Amber, that's me, I don't know why I'm speaking in third person all of a sudden, but I got some dope ass content coming your way. I've got some amazing ideas and some videos that I can do that does not require me to leave the house that much, simply because it's not safe at the time. So I've been thinking and writing down ideas and just kind of cogitating on, that's a nice size word, ain't it? Yes, cogitate. Mm. <laughs> so I've been thinking on it and I've got some dope ass ideas that I wanna do that I mentioned to you guys a few videos ago. So don't you worry guys, the Professionally Silly channel is not taking a hiatus during this time. I got work to do. And uh, bringing smiles to your faces is my job. Make sure you go ahead and smash that subscribe button if you haven't already, because trust me, you don't want to miss what I got coming. And you probably already missed a few past videos, so go ahead and check out those past videos that you may have missed, because I got lots of them. Maybe you have something you want me to try on my I'll Try That segment, or maybe you have something that you want to send me for my What's My Box segment, who knows? My P.O. Box is down in the description below. You can write me letters, whatever you want to do, just send it to me down below in my P.O. Box. If you find you're having a hard time waiting every Sunday for your refill of the silly? Well, don't worry about that, because like I said, I got myself a podcast where I upload a new podcast episode every Friday. And on my other social medias, if you follow me on my TikTok, World's Greatest Videos, Twitter, Instagram, I don't really do Snapchat as much, but I'm trying to do better at that. You follow me on my social media platforms there, you have a chance to enjoy your silly throughout the week. I'ma be all up in your phones. So uh, before we end this video, I wanna go ahead and uh, shout out all of my new subscribers. Thank you guys so much for giving me a chance and uh, letting me molest your screens. I really appreciate it. <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> that got weird. And also uh, big ups to all of my returning viewers as well. All my supporters, fans, whatever you wanna call yourselves. You are a Smile Squad member and I really appreciate your support. Guys, we are so close to getting to 10K subscribers. Go ahead and tell everybody you know to go ahead and smash that subscribe button. Here's what you do, okay? You grab the phones, open up the YouTube app, subscribe, give them the phone back. They don't even gotta know about it, okay? We have work to do. If you haven't already seen it, make sure you guys go ahead and check out the new channel trailer that I just made. I uploaded it this week. So technically we got ourselves an extra video this week, but not really. <laughs> make sure you guys go ahead and check out my new channel trailer. It took a long time to make. It may be under three minutes, but I tell you what, it took a long time to make. <laughs> So that way, uh, when your friends and your family are like, well, what's it about? What do, what, do, what do they do in this channel? Show them that channel trailer and they'll be like, oh, okay, yeah, I fucks with that. Yeah. And then they'll be like, oh, they'll subscribe. Watch, you'll see. You'll all see. I'm sure you guys aren't quite ready to say your goodbyes just yet. So I'm gonna go ahead and throw you some hydration for your thirst. Enjoy these silly ass videos that I made on other social media platforms. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. <laughs> hey, sir. Can you Google when the...
Oh no, lil bitch, back the fuck up right fucking now. What? A, put me down, bitch, I'm not playing with your ass. Bro, you tripping, just Google it. No I whore, just wash them hands. I wish I can Google if you got the virus. Nasty ho. Period poo. The nervous series, bro, I tell you. It may get bigger, it may get a little bigger, it may not get bigger at all. We'll see what happens. But regardless of what happens, we're totally prepared. Good afternoon. We interrupt your regularly scheduled news feed for this urgent public safety announcement. Titties are not pockets. I repeat, titties are not pockets. If you are going through my checkout line and pull dollar bills, credit cards, forms of identification, and God forbid change from your titties, please excuse my terrified and disgusted expression. Place what you have on the counter in front of me. Hold your breath and take a few steps back while I unload a can of Lysol on that nasty shit. Scrape it into the register where hopefully it will have time to disinfect from whatever the hell else you got in there before contaminating the rest of the cash in the drawer that will be redistributed back into the public. Remember, America, titties are not pockets. All right, guys, that's it for me on this one, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Parmesan cheese and lotion.